so in the postman so I'll create a get request so let's go and get the URL for the get request so let's go back to the API gateway and um, uh, from here let's go to the get API request so copy this URL go back in the postman and paste this URL so for the sign requests so I wanna I wanna select the AWS signature from the authorization type menu in the API gateway in the sorry in the postman so I'll select that so so right now I need to give the access key secret key uh, AWS region and the service name that is the execute API uh, or if uh, I'm using STS so I, I can give the session token over here so uh, and uh, like there is a other information like um, the Amazon date so all these parameters will be used to generate uh, a hash so that is uh, and that hash uh, uh, will be part of uh, this request and that would be sent to uh, to the API gateway and uh, so so after giving this access key and secret key so if I hit the send request so if I click uh, send then you will see I'm getting the response uh, the same thing I can do with the post request let's go to the post and then select uh, the URL for the post method and then go back uh, to the postman and uh, then type um, the URL over here and then in the body select the raw body and uh, then I'll just send a description bananas and uh, price um, let's say 1.76 dollars so and then I'll send that to saying because like um, I'm not providing the authorization and uh, and the access key and the secret access key so if I go back in the authorization and you can see like I'm not providing any access key and a secret access key um, so for that um, I'll give the access key and secret key in the in the back end and I'll test it again so after giving the access key and the secret access key let's test it again so right now if I hit the send button you can see right right now I'm getting uh, the success uh, API code and like I'm getting this um, body message that my item is saved so that's mean uh, our signed API gateway requests are working so next we will test these API's using the node.js code